morning it's about 10 to 7 it's early and i've just done my walk around the building and what have you and i've got the new mics uh just inside my coat here so the old bus going past yeah i mean you've probably seen me uh vlog this morning um you know uh, on the new camera and that you know it's in these um mics uh, i showed you in windy conditions yesterday so and the, quite impressive you know as i said let's swing around yeah they're quite impressive because uh the 995 and you know i think they're nine pound 95 huh, you know and you you, you 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 can't get no for that really in this country and uh, maybe a, a couple of pints of milk on the plus side the uh the closed road pathway seems to be open and uh we're down to one little area. So there might there might be uh, closing that down today. Get that sorted out. Oh, yes. So um, these mics are very good and uh i've got to do some more testing on them uh i mean the phone itself is waterproof uh which it brings it up to uh you know the standards of doing vlogs out in the, the rain and the mic's plugged in the bottom i think they are waterproof which is more than dji are I'll do some confirmation of that. Excuse me. The thing is that not everybody's got a lot of money. And Timu have got the tech. Just do a search and you'll see how much tech they do do. You know, whatever you want seems to be on there, which is amazing. The wind seems to be coming northbound, so I'm expecting a bit of a draft on the front. And we're already at three minutes. So, as per every other vlog, we'll pause you and we'll start you down the bottom. Oh, these uh, mics, by the way, uh, they've got something like a, a six hour battery life. So, that's on par with... Um, DJI. The only thing that DJI's got is a uh, internal storage. You know. Anyway, see you down the front. <sighs> yeah. So I've been drinking the Actimel drinks and eating eating those uh, yogis, gut friendly or whatever they are. I was watching a, a video the other day from this doc. He's really good. She talks about the body and you know she was on about how you stop the acid and what have you uh, she's very good she's done a few books and she was saying we need to drink two points two point one liters a day of uh water that's what we need to replenish because of what our body gets rid of and uh we we and uh it comes out of our skin and you, you name it, we lose about two litres a day and people aren't replacing that. Uh, so you get feeling of, uh, you know, tiredness and what have you. So, but I mean, two litres is a lot to drink and I'm not a, a fond water drinker, to be honest, you know. Um... Yeah, I mean, I can drink two litres of milk 
quite easily and I don't mind that. And I mean, that's got nutrients in them, surely, and everything else. But apparently it doesn't replace water. And then you get all these reports of the water being polluted and God knows that and this, that and the other. And you don't know what to do for the best. I mean, if I did have water, I would have to add something like Ribena to it. Because uh, the water doesn't taste the same as the old days, you know. Um, can't trust anything really. Um, I say I'm very impressed with these mics and uh, I've still got to do some more tests on that uh, hand camera thing um, but uh, I just got that uh, you know uh, for ghost hunts and that maybe with a booster so yeah I think today the uh, well, the moon's up there somewhere, you can just go see it. But no sign of the sun yet. I mean, they, the weather's gone to, I don't know, crap. And I don't know what's up with my sister. I keep texting her and she doesn't respond back. So uh, maybe she's dumped me, I don't know. Well, life goes on, doesn't it? Life goes on. I say this uh, team I spent a lot of money with them recently getting uh, generally old sketcher pads and what are you sketch pads um, where you had to turn the dials and draw well I got them on there with a pen for four, four pounds like it is and it's ridiculous ridiculous and I mean, well, that's with, you know, if you get 10 quid's worth, you get the postage free. I mean, does that not tell you that we're being robbed in this country? Uh, one guy in the web, um, on the web said, what have you said? Uh, I've left the UK because it's one of the most expensive countries. And he's got to be right. I mean, it's good. Now we're getting a rule put in to evict um, the troublemakers that have come in the country on the boats. I mean, you know, we announced a new rule yesterday and uh, send them to Rwanda or somewhere. And uh, that's good because it's worrying the hell out of everybody in the country. You know, it, how these rapists and what have you come into the country and uh, the government didn't seem to be doing anything to do it but it's past parliament now so hopefully we'll see some yeah, mic fell off uh, hopefully we'll see some uh, expectation of uh, people. Oh, lordy, 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 lordy. You're always worried about your mics dropping off. Luckily, it made a clunk clunk and I wasn't on the grass. Uh, well, camera shows a little bit more light than I can see. Uh, the sun's rising across there, and the church is there. I'm still in low light. Oh my god. See, I mean, at this time yesterday, well, not yesterday, the day before, it was like too windy. And uh, yeah, yesterday was very windy. Anyway, I'm going to leave you with that on the front. And I'll catch you later. Bye for now. <laughs>